With Juniper Abstra's Terraform provider, we can now use Terraform to automate Abstra with Terraform configuration files. I'm going to show you how to build a data center fabric suitable for AI workloads using Terraform instead of using the UI. First, we have a bunch of design elements that need to be created or picked before we create our data center. Logical devices represent individual switches, their speeds, profiles, and number of ports. We also need to design our racks before we can build a data center, and then assign them to a template which represents how our data center will look. Once we have those elements, we can create a representation of the data center called a blueprint. If we hop over to our Terraform files, we can see those same items are reflected here. We have our racks, we have our templates, we have our logical devices, and finally, we have our blueprint. What I'm going to do now is to run a Terraform apply. That's going to take all of the configuration that we need to build our AI-ready data center and push it out to Abstra and create our data center config. Here, Terraform is telling us what changes it's going to make in terms of adding logical devices, racks, templates, and finally, a blueprint. Let's agree and watch it run. Once we get to completion, we can hop over and take a look at what our blueprint looks like. And we are done. This took a little bit longer because it's a virtual environment. I've sped it up for you, but now we can see that we've created a brand new blueprint. We've also created the individual rack types, as I mentioned. So we've got different rack types that we could have chosen. We selected a particular rack type of 16 spines and 320 leaves. We built this in just a few minutes using Terraform. Let's hop into the blueprint and take a look at what we've done. We can see our positively massive 16 spine AI ready data center here in our staged configuration. One would only need to fill out information, which you could do with Terraform for ASN and IP address information and add hardware. If we had the hardware required, we could push this configuration and have a data center ready to start spinning up workloads. Thank you for watching this demo.